This is Twit. Just as Moore's Law has taken over the silicon market, there has to be an equivalent to how fast new cutting-edge technology has been hacked as well. You may have heard about Apple's new M1 ARM-based silicon powering their latest MacBooks. Not only has the M1 made a significant impact on the market, but it has also caught the interest of hackers as well, especially the ethical research kind. That's right. Only a couple months after M1 was released, malicious code is already natively on the platform. The CPU supports an ARM64 instruction set. For a binary to natively run on M1, it must be compiled as a Mach 064-bit ARM64 binary, which means developers must recompile their applications to be native on them. Apple realized that backwards compatibility was essential to ensure widespread customer adoption on new M1 systems, and it released Rosetta 2. Now, Rosetta will transparently translate those Intel instructions in the native ARM64 so the older applications can actually run seamlessly. Now, with the help of virus searching tools recently, a malicious binary was actually found on M1 devices supporting both Intel and Apple Silicon called Go search 22.app. Guess what? That thing is malicious. And not only that, it was signed by an Apple developer ID as well. Newly highly sought after silicon means it will be the, in the crosshairs of malicious actors and as well as researchers.